Hey guys, Ethan Bailey here. Hope you're having a fantastic week and welcome to the YouTube video. Now in this video, what I'm going to do is break down exactly how we find high converting, really good angles, where we source these angles from, which websites we look at, and where we kind of get this information of what the consumer actually wants. Because people make a lot of mistakes when it comes to mountain angles and they go really broad and shall like want better skin, things like that. That's obviously very, very important. People do want, you know, better skin. But an example of this is one... No acne free skin without the dryness, for example, because it's a very big problem. A lot of acne products, you know, make your skin go dry, which leads to flakiness, itchiness, and sometimes even bleeding. So that's just an example of what we're going to cover in this video. But if you find this video helpful, feel free to hit the subscribe button. And if you have any questions, drop them in the comment section below. Without further ado, let's get into the video. So, guys, let's dive in. So, here's a post I did <clears throat> yesterday. Basically, explains the fact that angles seem to have be like the hardest part about when you pay down. People struggle to find good converting angles. I mean, angles are everywhere, but good ones are quite hidden. And it's a very, very easy problem to fix. There's three main places to look, but in this video, I'm going to go through the five places I look. I've put up some examples. Now, <clears throat> just for some context, the niche we're going for here is acne. So we're looking for angles around acne and how to get rid of it and solutions for it. So the first thing I go on is foreplay. Fullbay is basically a software where you can create an account and you've got a range of so many different ads across the platform. Now, I'd stay away from the brand expert ads and all them. Maybe the, the brand area is not bad, but the expert, all those ads are outdated and you clearly don't use this enough to keep updated. So I'll stay away from that and focus more on the discovery community section, which is this bit here. Now, I go through and I'm thinking of different angles. Like, for example, we've got one here that says, I wish I had smoother skin. Um, which basically is obviously inclined that the desire for the market is people just wish they had smoother skin. It's something everyone looks at. So an angle could be want smoother skin, that type of thing. Very, very simple. Now, that's a, that's an okay angle, but I'm going to show you how you can go deeper and get a higher converting one. This is kind of where people stop. They'll see something like this and they'll go, you know what, that's a good angle, want smoother skin. And I'm going to show you how you can go deeper and get a better one than that. So your next stop is Reddit. You could be on here for hours looking for different ideas. But this is just a chat room I found. As you can see, I typed in acne skincare solutions. And it says right here, honestly, any chemical foiling is good for acne and it won't dry your skin out. So one problem that he's telling me here is that a lot of acne solutions dry out people's skin. Now, obviously, if you know skincare, dry skin can lead to uh, more severe acne scars. It can lead to itchiness, it can flakiness, bleeding, etc. So maybe a good angle could be uh, one acne-free skin without the dryness or something like that that's another really good angle you can see the difference straight away from our first one uh, our first hook well the first angle was our smooth wanting smoother skin and our second angle is having acne free skin that won't uh, dry your skin out so want acne free skin without the dryness that type of thing now another place i like to look is tiktok there's a load you could be on here all day there's loads of different ones there's kind of two things i tend to look for one, I'm looking for industry experts, be that dermatologists, doctors, scientists, biologists, whatever. I always start there. And the second place I look for is those places where it's just people doing like a my skincare routine day in the life. They're the kind of two places I look. When it comes for a more personalized approach, I look at the typical, you know, day in the life, my skincare routine. However, when I want accurate information and, you know, solid specific to the niche i go straight for dermatologist content like this so you can see here do you have any budget friendly alternatives i'm poor so they're basically saying obviously that they can't afford it so that could be a good angle there what an acne free solution that doesn't break the bank for example something like that so there's another angle right there and um, it's just about finding what the customer actually actually wants and then creating an angle around then i'm just looking in the comment section here a few different tiktoks this is a dermatologist page and if you really want to you can go and type in like i said look for skincare day in the life my skincare routine my skincare routine review how i keep my skin so clear those type of videos and just go through the comment section of them and obviously there's a lot you could go you've gone for ages on here and obviously you've got loads of different ideas and another one is youtube so i always type like acne solutions or tutorials and i go straight on to youtube and I look in the comment section so i'm looking for things like here professor s i had the worst acne of my life a few weeks ago actually cause a lot of pain and discomfort. So a good angle here could be, is acne causing you pain and discomfort? Or are you feeling, you know, are acne insecurities getting you down? Or, you know, that kind of thing. So you can see straight away how we're getting a few different hooks or 
for example, or different angles, or want cleared up acne skin in a week, something like that. But um, cause a lot of pain, this gum is a good one because uh, obviously it's a very, very common thing. So create an ad around the idea of tired of acne causing you pain or is your acne causing you pain or is your acne causing you discomfort, that type of thing. They're just brainstorming because what you want to do with angles is you just get an angle like this, like acne causes pain discomfort. Then you want to spend about 30 minutes drafting out just the text that you're going to say in the ad. Very, very simple. Uh, just put a hook down, do the body, and then I spend another half an hour just on the hook alone. So within 60 minutes, I have a high converting ad script of just the text. For the 20 minutes, just adding the visual elements underneath, and then we're okay. There's another video on my channel if you want to check out how I, how I do this. Uh, there's one post the other day about how I generated about 340 hours in one day from one ad. So, yeah, it's a, it's a great video. That shows it in more detail. But another really good one that is kind of slept upon is Trustpilot. Now, on here, there's, you find the real, real kind of like juice because, again, people can be anonymous or they can be, you know, active. And people tend to tell stories on here. Like, you can see, sadly, this doesn't make a difference. Angle straight in my head is getting, okay, can we create an ad around the idea of people getting tired of, of products not doing, you know, not making a difference? So, tired of wasting money on loads of acne products that don't work? Or are you fed up of awful acne solutions or things like that so there are a few different angles you can do and this is just based off and obviously you want to read the one star and the five star reviews you can see here a lot of people are telling stories about how like the 16 year old daughter or son or whatever has managed to be able to clear their acne by using this product so you want to make sure you're looking at you know five and the one star. So you see here 16 year old suffering from fairly bad acne you know, how my 16-year-old cleared his skin from bad acne in 30 days. You know, no angles like that. So, yeah, and you can go through things like, so we've got, you know, Trust Pilot, etc. But there's loads of other ones, but these are kind of the five main ones I use. And you get some really good angles. Like, we've been on this now for six minutes, and we've already got five different angles. Some obviously are a bit shallow, but if we brainstorm them together, we can convert those five angles into one kind of deep angle. And then within two hours after that, we've got our first high converting ad script. So guys, that's exactly the five places where I do most of my research when I'm looking for good angles. You can see there's not a lot of videos on YouTube that actually talk about this because it's a very, very, very good place to look. And obviously, you know, a lot of YouTubers preach this. Everyone would be better at running ads in the industry. So yeah, I would strongly suggest looking at these five places. There's obviously more. You can look at Instagram comments, LinkedIn, Twitter, Pinterest, whatever. But the ones I've covered in here are your probably strongest five to find good marketing angles. And again, if you find this video helpful, feel free to subscribe button below. Any questions, drop in the comment section below. And if you want me to run your ads, look in the description below where it says, have Ethan Bailey run my ads. Click that link there. Should have a very, very quick 10, 15 minute chat with me and we'll assess if you are a good fit to work with us. So that is everything. Hope you enjoy your day and I'll see you next time.